<laughs> this is a run back, and we're gonna see a different. This is gonna be a different character uh, pick coming out from Pulse, who we're actually uh, known to see him since his actual main in the very beginning of the game. You hate that Tweety is making this all about him. Okay. Oh, good anti air coming out from Pulse. I wonder if Jay can punish that with Shadow Kick. I feel like she could. It's minus 13. Good fall spike on the down one. Okay, taking the first round there. Round two. Fight. Talia, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Okay, he's going to get caught trying to go for a poke right there. And just, yeah, that's what we see coming out from Scar sometimes is actually uh, going for a down two off of Delia after Delia's dance because uh, Scar likes to say that most players are not blocking after this situation. Oh, tries to go for another command grab. Good read coming out from Scar into the pole vault to tie this up one round apiece. Yeah, yeah, Toby. Uh, Aaron's actually Pulse's original main, I believe. Mm -hmm. Okay. Amplified use of Scud Shot. It has glow, and there's not much Aaron can really do right there. Pulse does have a slight light lead. Here he's trying here. to take that back with the chip, though. And I think both players are just content with just being patient and just waiting this whole entire time. And as I say that, here comes the offense. Oh yeah, Scratch Shot just going right through Glow. Down four into the back two is gonna connect and is gonna Oh, and that's the KB. Oh, drops it though. Hold on. Oh, that's gonna be chip on Damn, the pole ball right damage. there. Oh, Foxy, thank you so much for the raid. That's a large raid, much love. Thank you. I appreciate it, much love. Chat, those who are new and uh, new to the channel, welcome. This is Den of Wolves Week 2. We are down to our final four players. Han Rashid is currently sitting in winner's side grand finals. Tweety is currently sitting in the loser side uh, finals. And the winner of this is going to meet Tweety. Uh, it is a top three payout indeed also. So this match is really important as far as who's going to get into the money. Oh, and I actually need to update... Um, the scoreboard because that amount is not right. It's actually two hundred and sixty-five dollars for the players. Yes, Han. Yes, it's sixty thirty ten split. Oh, just throws out the glow in time to prevent the low shadow right there. Oh, tries to get a conversion off of the pole vault. Oh, good punish. Notice that Pulse didn't have any offensive meter right there. Good check coming out from Pulse. Yeah, and one thing about Noob's throw range is actually significant good distance uh, to be able to 
catch the opponents uh, compared to a lot of other throw animations. No false block on that last hit. He's gonna go for air glaives. That is gonna be plus to make sure to give Scar an extra turn. Trying to find a shimmy attempt. He's just gonna get the short hop, and that is gonna be another round on the board for Scar. Round two, fight. Watch Delia's dance. Yeah, that is going to be a high coming out for Noob Cyborg too. And right now, Scar just has him locked down into the corner. Okay, he's gonna find a back throw. He's gonna put Scar into the corner now. Oh, just a wake up down two. Okay, good down three check. Oh, this should be damn near chip. Oh, yeah, it is gonna trade with the back one and the sweep right there, and Scar's gonna be up now 2 0 on pulse. And this is a run back. Scar in, uh, Scar in full control. I wonder if Pulse will make another switch. Yeah, this is a... Uh, we're, we're seeing Pulse. Uh, we saw uh, the Jackie pick come uh, in the beginning uh, whenever they first played in Winners. And we've seen two different characters. We've seen the Noob Saiba and we've seen Aaron Black. Both of them have not been working. Uh, so now Pulse is down to his final pick as far as who's going to be locked in for the rest of this set. J. Uh, and Tweety, I'll go ahead and let you uh, take over. I'm going to use the restroom again. Okay, so again, we're going to use the restroom. Paul's actually going to go with Kung Lao. Kung Lao is definitely one of his better characters, but uh, I'm not really sure how this matchup goes with these two. Kung Lao versus Jade. I got to imagine it's kind of an uphill battle for Kung Lao to get going. But maybe once he gets going, he's uh, he can do something. Round one, fight. Kissed him with the down four into the back two. Scar not re or uh, Pulse not respecting the plus range. Ooh, drops the conversion there though. Pulse maybe could have killed without fatal there, but just wants to make sure. Fuck it. Yeah, I think if he was absolutely optimal, he could have killed without it, but whatever. Just, just make sure. Spin the sack. Round two, fight. Who kissed him with the hat? Goes for the air to air there. That was a good idea, but Scar just a little too quick with the glaive. Ooh, makes him whiff, no punish though. Ooh, nice grab. It's a good situation here for Pulse. He needs to make something happen in this corner. Gets the grab again. Looking like the ghost of Splash Man. Ooh, gets the air to air. Nice block from Scar, staying solid. Catches him though, trying to anti air. Ooh, and he drops it, but it doesn't matter. He picks up the. Uh, well, that was weird there. He uh, he dropped it, but Scar just is not ready to block the uh, the spin. Yeah, I probably didn't anticipate that the combo was going to drop right there. Uh, and it was actually able to get a reset. And that could have been scary ter uh, territory right there uh, for Pulse. Because I, I believe Scar had Fatal Blow right there. So uh, that could have just been a punish into Fatal Blow, which would have gave Scar that round to tie it up and put him on match point. But nonetheless, Pulse is going to stay alive. Yo, I got P. I'll be right back. All right, I will take over. All righty.
fight. This definitely does look like uh, another one of the like harder matchups for WoW because not able to really jump as much and he has to really uh, work his way in as far as the neutral game on Jade. And Jade actually outranges WoW on most situations with either down four or back two. So it's going to be interesting. I mean, we did see the adjustments coming out from Pulse last game. And there's another good read on the roll. There's going to be a good pickup. Just go for the armor breaker either. Just going to go ahead and just get the knockdown, get a forward throw. Okay. Good whiff punish on the back two. Big combo incoming. Goes for the Z hat. Oh, not caught blocking. And he's just going to go ahead and cash out. With the Fatal Bow, this is going to give Scar the life lead now. Oh, the Fatal Bow is going to go right through the Air Glaives. It's going to armor its way out. And that is going to be the round for Pulse. One path is better. Hold on. Oh, tries to go for the orbiting hat, but not going to work. Yep, that is a mind game because that last part of the string is an overhead. Okay, good pickup coming out from Pulse. Okay, down one. And down one on block into the back throw. That is an indeed mind game coming out from Kung Lao, especially if he has orbiting hat. Down three, yep, then to the one, two, one, sh shimmy. It's gonna pay off, big damage, and it's gonna be a hard knockdown to the Z-Hat. Tries to go for the interactable, okay. Interrupts the glow, and is gonna get the orbiting hat. If he doesn't drop this, this should be death. In, uh, you know, I was reading the chat too, uh, you know, from other uh, WoW players such as like Shaolin who's in the chat and he uh, was saying that this matchup is actually really difficult for WoW, uh, but we're seeing otherwise as Pulse actually, you know, this is, he was locked in, he was down 2-0, down to one character pick and he picks WoW and now he has tied this up 2-2 with Scar and this is once again, I'm going to remind everyone, a big match because the winner of this is going to get into top three. And top three is going to be paid out indeed. Um, and, you know, loser of this is going to end at fourth place. No money, unfortunately. Um, so it's definitely going to be a big match right here. Round one, fight. I'm back, mate. I'm back, lads. Oh, he jumps out of the a gap of the extended strings. Okay, is gonna get the shimmy. Ooh, the shimmy. Calling up Jimmy. Mm, okay. So throw counter on the roll. Another throw that back throw that's gonna put Pulse into the corner. Good patience. No falls back on that last part of the hit. Oh, Trish tries to overextend with the dive kick, expecting Scar to press a button. It's gonna get caught by the orbiting hat. Oh, and he gets the full convert. Also gonna be one touch here away. One opening. Okay. Oh, nice counter cook with the grab. Oh, just tries to go for a raw down two. It's not going to pay off. Air Glaives, yeah, no. Just tries to go for the raw fatal. It's yeah. not going to pay off. Scar is on match point now. Round two, fight. Oh, just the start of the round glow kick. Scar trying to steam steamroll here. Oh, he's going to get the shimmy into Delia's dance, a re-stand. Air Glaives just for extra plus frames. Tough situation right now for Pulse. He is down significant in life. Scar has not been touched either. Okay. 
Okay, he's gonna find an opening. Oh, just a wake up down two coming out from Scar. Oh, doesn't believe. Hold on. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Goes for the Z hat. Into a back throw. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. He doesn't get guaranteed pressure off this, though. Oh, just tries to go for oh the my one god, two. Just for it. Yeah, he just tries to go for the one two into the I fatal. It. And it's it. not going to work out, and Scar is going to prevent the reverse 3 0. And is going to take it 3 to 2 over Pulse to eliminate him at fourth place.